Hello everybody, it's Ross and welcome back to Stray. Um, 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 it's been it's been a while since I haven't played this game, and to be fair, I think every everybody by now just like finished this game, and I did not because I'm so slow on playing anything. To be honest, when Scorn came out, I just like focused that game like right away because I really enjoyed playing Scorn, and I think it was like a great experience. But I haven't really had time. To just like come back and to just like you know play the game and record and stuff and actually finish the game i know we're not too far from beating the game i just don't remember 100 sure what we have to do i know we spoke with clementine and that was like our goal and i think she sent me to see someone and um, which i think it's like in a prison or something like that from what i understood so we have to do that next I think this game is like around like 5-6 hours long, so I have like 4 hours and something into the game itself. So I think we're safe to say that we're like close to beat it. I just need to find a way out of this apartment. Okay, here it is, the way out. Okay, cool. Uh, it's kind of sucky that I couldn't talk with Clementine again to see uh, who exactly I was supposed to find because now I'm just gonna go like randomly looking for that person because I don't know exactly um, where I need to go but yeah a bomber jack and a gold chain okay so I need to find a guy that's wearing a bomber jacker and uh, and a gold chain that's the person that I'm looking for I don't know exactly if I saw that guy uh, but I'm gonna look for him and then just like obviously be back once we find him Okay guys, so I think I found the person I was looking for. Took me a little bit of just like asking around and stuff like that. Where did you get that? Oh, you're with Ots, my contact. Let me brief you about the atomic battery. Ah, that sounds interesting. Also, if you hear like something in the background, you just that was me. <laughs> I just put some music on something and it's like really loud. The battery is powered in that core factory right there, but this whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. They check every person who enters and turns away anyone who is not a worker. Okay. I'm not a worker, but I think I'm small and I can sneak around. Here's an idea. Go get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here to check for a good time to go to, go, to enter. To enter, yeah. I don't know exactly why you came to go, but yeah. So we need to find those two. A worker helmet and a worker jacket, okay. Sounds reasonable enough. I guess doable. Which is exactly why I put music to play in a guy's shop, but hey. Let's talk to Gary. Okay, so it's gonna take me a little bit to look for those. Maybe that's why I play music. Maybe the shopkeeper is having like a helmet and a, and a vest somewhere. I need to... Yep, I see it over there. Because I think that's why I was playing music in the back so I can distract him, but I just basically did it out of order. Like, you can still hear the music, right? It's pretty loud. Okay, so we found uh, the jacket in here. But not the helmet yet, so I need to find a helmet in a different location. Maybe I need like an item or something. So I'm gonna go look for that. <laughs> it's funny because I think he noticed that he's missing. I'm curious if I can talk to him. Hmm. I'm gonna be dealing with te theft right now. I'm not gonna give it back to him because we need it, but I was gonna have to look for the helmet. So we got the um, vest from like the vest shop. Or a clothes shop and he said this guy here said like there should be somewhere like a head shop which i think i saw before but i passed next to it so i need to find that and probably there's a head there i just need to find a way to get that as well okay i found the head shop it's here i just need to find a way to either get in or just getting somehow okay so i cannot enter the shop while it's being restocked so I need some item or some sorts. Okay guys, so in order to get in the shop, I had to basically wake this guy up, which is kind of drunk, I guess. I guess that's the point. He just like, he was sleeping. And then I just, uh, you know, got in a box so I can get inside the shop and steal the hat. <laughs> it's kind of funny, but... 
Apparently they don't give a shit. So let's steal that. Cool, so we got a hat and we got what we needed. Now we just need to go back and deliver the hat because the vest I already gave. Okay, so here is my guy. Let's give him the hat as well. I did find one, just let me give it to him. Okay, so now we have like an entire outfit for our guy, so probably we have to get into this factory and then we have to do something inside from the factory. These are great, a little snug around the waistline, but it also do, okay. Okay, hop in the box and I'll sneak you across the checkpoint. Cool, that's nice. <laughs> We're just like doing missions and stuff as a cat. It's really hilarious. I'm looking forward to also play like other games. I do have other stuff that I want to play. It's kind of sad I'm not able to upload that often, but like not too many people are active on this channel as well. So in in a way, I, I don't like kind of like regret it 100% because there's not that many people that are watching it. I'm not doing, uh, in my opinion, like, you know, it's not anything revolutionary when it comes to content and stuff. I'm just mostly doing gameplays and stuff like that. And maybe people just don't want to play the game without actually watching someone play it or someone else already play it, which is like a, a big YouTuber or stuff like that. But basically, I do want to still do it when I can. And still trying to do it weekly, even though I might not be able to. But I'm trying to keep at it. Well, I have time because it's fun to play games and record and just like comment over. Find it, I find that enjoyable. So, we're like inside the factory now. I got found already. Which I didn't know was a thing. Okay, trying not to get shot here, shot here, I mean. Oh, I died. I I didn't know exactly that that could happen. So now I did learn my lesson, but it was a little bit ruthless. Maybe they could have just like given us a hint or something before that happened. I mean, it's obviously, you know, restricted and it's guarded. So probably, you know, the, the hint is like, don't go there. But now I do know that this area has dangerous. So yeah. Just to be careful. Okay, that seems to to went over, so let's go this way. Okay, that's stationary over there. Okay, I can hide in the boxes. That's the you know metal uh, metal gear, metal snake. I don't even know. This metal metal gear is what I'm trying to say. The metal gear way. You know when like snake is hiding in the boxes. Snake! Snake! I haven't played the games to be fair, but I know the memes and I've saw other people playing them. Which is also nice. It's pretty straight route, it's not too hard to go through here once you just actually know that they can fuck you up. I'm not gonna try to meet this guy here, I don't see the point, but I mean, why not actually? Hey, good thing you're here, you can help, okay? I lost the keys to my place in this dark and huge factory. <laughs> The sentinels refused to help me, they told me, if no place to go, more work here. <laughs> nice. If by any chance you could help me find them, I'll be eternally grateful. Cool, if I find them, I'll let you know. I just need not to get killed first. This is a pretty simple concept. Okay, looks like we can use this here. Which I'm not sure exactly what it does. Oh, it opens that door. Okay, this is more tricky than I thought. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go try to find the keys. Like, I, I was thinking to do that, but I was... I don't know. I'm not I'm not sure if there is, like, another path. That's what I'm trying to say. Maybe there is, but I missed it. If I found them, like, by any chance, randomly, then sure. But if not, then... Uh, oh, no, that's not good. Uh, it's looking for me. Well, I think I maybe got away. It's close. It's close. Almost died. So if they're looking for you, you can hide in the boxes, basically. And they're not going to kill you for now. Can I go into this? Okay, nice. 
So I guess there is more paths to go. So maybe there is some keys over here somewhere. I'm not sure if it's forward or it's back there or that's a shortcut. I don't really know, but who knows? We'll see. Okay, so I have two ways to go. I think I can use this barrel to go inside there. Which is an interesting way to do that. I think I can go around the other way and see if I can find maybe those keys. I'm not sure exactly if that's the case, but I could try to give it a go and see if it's not a shortcut. Okay guys, so I'm not sure exactly if this is the way, but I'm not gonna go back. The reason being like that, the game is actually really harsh and like punishing this area. And it says of like, I did not know if you die in this area, you go all the way back to the beginning. And I realized that like, you know, once it happened, and I'm not trying to just like, try to do stuff all over it again, so... I don't know, maybe if the key quest is gonna be part of like something I need to do, like you know, like main for the main quest, I'll do it. But if not, I think I'll just like uh, try to like you know do what I have to do. Okay, guys, looks like I made it. There was like another bot which I needed to use. I didn't realize that. But now I think I need to move one of those to just like lower this maybe. Okay guys, I understand now, the battery is in here, it's in this thing. So what I was trying to do is actually take the battery, not really pass the barrel through that. So I'm gonna need to get the barrel to the other side so I can actually go that way. That's not the case, I need to do the barrel on this pressure plate uh, in order to get the battery. I really didn't understand that. I don't, I'm not a big fan, like, if you're watching my channel, like, from some time, you probably understand me that I'm not a big fan of puzzles, I, I really can't stand puzzles, to be fair. Okay, so we got the battery. So I need to find a way out now. That would be the only way out I can see, but the problem is, like, I'm not able to... These things are... Oh, never mind, it's, there's no sensor anymore, okay, cool. Oh, there's a bucket actually here, <laughs> the back bucket elevator. Okay, so now we have to take the battery back to Clementine, so I'm gonna go do that. Okay, so it looks like there's a little bit of also stealth in here, because now th these guys are after Clementine, I guess, so I need to be careful not to get shot. Okay, so I don't remember exactly where Clementine was, because my memory is shitty. I know there's like a hole somewhere, but I don't know exactly where. Uh, there. Okay, cool. Probably she's hiding from these guys because she doesn't want to get captured and stuff like that. It makes sense. Okay, so we're we're back here. All those sentinels buzzing around. Very strange. I hope nothing happened to Clementine. Let's find her. I hope that either, to be honest, because I bet as well. I hope nothing happened to her. Okay, so Clementine it's not here, but she left a message for me, which I don't know exactly what it is. But I need to find out probably where I need to go next, and currently I don't really know that. Okay, so it looks like we found a drawer here, which basically I think Clementine maybe left something behind for us. Oh, or maybe just use it to go up here. Okay. So, she's not here either. So, what's that? This gem is uh, of medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something useful. Bingo, there is a message, a message that says Blazer. Okay, so I need to find Blazer again, I guess. That's my best guess. So, let's do that. Okay, so it looks like we have still something else to find i didn't realize that because i wasn't sure i was thinking maybe i need to find again blaze but um it looks like there's not there is another clue in here somewhere okay i, I just needed to find like come to for some reason like it, it it wasn't okay with i'm with blazer nightclub that didn't make sense for me right <laughs> Okay, cool, but that was all, so now we can go. Okay, so we're here. The problem is, how do we actually get into the nightclub now? Yep, this guy is not really too friendly towards me, so I'm not sure exactly how do I get in. Hey, how'd you get down here? You wanna party with us? Sure. Here, jump in. Go get a drink. Thank you, sir. 
I really much appreciate it. Now I just need to find the lands. And hopefully I'm not gonna get sick. I'm not sure exactly what triggered it, but... I think it's like a light or something like triggered. I, I, I'm not, I don't know for like having seizure or anything like that. It just triggered like a motion sickness thing into me, which has been getting worse. So, trying to finish what I have to do and then stop. Yeah, so it looks like finally I was able to find my way up here. And now, let's see what we can do from here. Okay, looks like I'm here. I'm not sure exactly what I'm looking for. I think I'm looking for, of course, like for Clementine and with uh, the other guy. But it's just like, I'm not sure exactly why they make them so complicated to, to find them, right? Like at the end of the game, maybe... Or just like towards the end of the game or whatever like why do they make them so complicated to be found it's like i don't enjoy puzzles i keep saying that like and if you have like too many like just stuck up on top of each other it's just like becoming frustrating and not enjoyable oh no did you get betrayed by blazer two birds with one stone you're not as clever as you look little cat anyways nothing personal business is business so we got betrayed business is money and I value money way more than friendship or camaraderie. Com camaraderie? Camaraderie? Can't say that. Camaraderie, yes, I'm not sure about the word. They're all yours. Who is he talking with? Oh, the boss. Oh no, we got electrocuted? Oh no, I got captured and put in a cage. It's now nice. I'm still a cat, so I'm probably gonna find a way to get out. But I'm not sure I want to fall in the water, though. Okay. That went well. Surprisingly, I, I thought I'm gonna fall into the water. But no. Okay, it went well. I'm gonna keep playing for a little bit because I know I have a little. I like. I have a little bit to cut out of this episode. I keep trying to keep like to one hour or something like that, but um. For some reason, like, now I'm feeling a little bit better, but, like, the club, the, the all the lights and the stuff, and I'm not sure exactly what just caused me to have, like, this just motion kind of sickness take over me. And usually this sick type of sickness is, like, only when I get when I'm, like, drunk, basically. And I don't usually drink. But, like, that's what it felt like. So, I need to probably stop at one point if I'm not going to get little bit better okay so it looks like there is an exit here so we can get out of here at least from the the first room so this is like a prison i guess it's nice to be a cat and to be so agile and stuff and you can do basically specific things which a robot wouldn't be able to do because a robot wouldn't be that fast or agile right so it's nice to have that as a cat. I think he's gonna come back, right? Can probably hide in the box. Yep. So I guess I'm gonna have to find Clementine probably. And just like my bot which was like on my back, but I don't know where he could be. Okay, so looks like we found Clementine. Looks like she's happy to see us. <laughs> I would be too. So we need her to get to the surface and also I need to recover my things. Or where exactly my companion through this entire journey. And her things I guess. How do we do that? So luckily being a cat like it comes with the perks of just like being able to kind of fit into through small places places so basically it's you have metal bars on your windows but if I'm a cat I'm too small and I can sneak in anyway so probably this is what she was like the room she was pointing out that we need to get into yep and what exactly is here maybe some keys yep there is some keys over there okay so I guess now we can free Clementine here you go now I just need to find my little companion. I don't know exactly where he is. I'm not gonna lose him because I got attached to him. Like it would be odd. I mean, of course I'm a cat, so 
it wouldn't be so bad to just like you know completely uh, leaving behind the sense of like you know I'm, I'm still a cat I need to go back to my old life I guess it would be bad to, it would be bad either to just keep him and just like be friends forever you know have him join me on the surface with Clementine and just like have a good time probably you're gonna recover him but you know it's just like a way to to see things I guess so we're just like following Clementine all sneaky like so let's see what she's doing oh Oh, look at him. I need to save him. He's my friend. He's my friend, do. Can leave him there. It's gonna be complicated now, isn't it? So I guess Clementine is gonna help me with it. I'm not sure. It looks like it to be fair. It's a lot of security though in here. More than usual I guess. Because they keep him captured like that, yeah. But anyway, I guess I think I'm gonna let's see. Yeah, it, it's been just a checkpoint here, so I think I'm gonna stop here. I, I wish I would play more. I'm sure it's trying to push this game for the end. Probably it's gonna be a, a little bit more cuts in this episode. I'm just not feeling too well. For some reason I just like I said I I got like um I'm not sure if it was the light or if were like too many motion like lights moving around and stuff. But like I got really hit with this nasty motion sickness, which is really weird because it, it doesn't happen to me too often but um like i said i played the game before of half five and happened to me as well i'm not sure exactly which one but like i know i was recording it for the channel and i was not able to finish it because of that and hopefully everything's gonna be all right because i played the game into that point and it's only happening that point so i'm gonna be able to finish it i'm probably gonna have to do by my estimate it's probably just one more episode on this game did I put like one more hour and something into it? Not sure if story wise was like just one hour, I guess. But I think we're pretty close to being it. Uh, I know it's been like taking a long time. I'm not sure, even sure if anyone is watching at this point. Uh, but yeah, I'll try to finish it. So if you're watching and you managed to stick until the end of this episode, thank you so much for watching. If you're on the channel and somehow you managed to also stick to the end of this episode, it's nice to have you. And don't forget to like support in any way you can. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Um,